Well, thank you, Dancy. As we promised, we are back here in Delphus. And yes, Andy and Zach are coming up very soon with food. And Mark's going to check out some of that as well. We are at the Creamery. And it doesn't matter where you live. I think if you are from Northwest Ohio, you've heard of the Creamery. Of course, there's great ice cream everywhere. But there's just something very unique about the Creamery here in Delphus. And part of it may be it's been in the family for a very long time. Dan, the owner, is here. Tell me a little bit about the history of the Creamery here. Um, my sister bought it in... Uh, 1996 uh, my brother bought it from her um, a little bit later and then a si my sister other sister bought it from him and then I bought it in 2012 uh, the creamery was originally started by Jerry Wessel in 1982 1982 it's been a staple here and one of the uh, staple things are go ahead and bring that over here this Wow is this a 12 dip 8 dip 15 dip this is a three dip and three dip cone. What, what kind of ice cream is this one? Black cherry. How many flavors do you have? 32 hard dip flavors. 32 hard dip flavors. All right. Well, this is what I've got to uh, consume. We are going to send it outside to Andy, Mark, and Zach because there's some new items that they are going to uh, try out. One thing they're not trying out is the new Dole products, right? Tell me about those. The Dole products are, we have six flavors and they're lactose free for the the customer that can't have the dairy product and that way the family can come out and they can all can enjoy something and what are some of the other new products the things that we are going to let them test try in a moment uh we have the new cappuccino crunch mocha flavor and the french vanilla flavor all right we're gonna head it outside i'm gonna dive into this and we'll let them see what other th del delicacies they can find well, thank you, Jennifer. We are, of course, over here in front oh, of the creamery enjoying some... Mark, we are on. Mm. You can see here, Mark Sorry. immediately grabbed the Buckeye Parfait, a variety of options here that we can't wait to dive into. The guys already have. Andy, your thoughts? Really good. I got the French vanilla. Cappuccino crunch. Shouldn't that be Freedom Vanilla? What we've got here... Freedom! Cappuccino crunch, mm. French vanilla Food, flavor. Freedom. Mocha flavor and and more food is arriving. This is a oh, delicious. chicken sandwich that just looks incredible. Actually, love shredded chicken. I love shredded chicken sandwiches. Mark, take us through the Buckeye Blitz and the uh, variety of flavors there. Well, you've got uh, the whipped cream. I'm trying to get down into the parfait level. Uh, you got some caramel in there, some peanut butter. It's a uh, you know it's it's a uh, it's like a, a buck candy Buckeye Buckeye mm, candy. Looks so. phenomenal. I... You got the peanut butter, the chocolate, vanilla, absolutely delicious. We haven't even talked about the banana split right here. Andy's getting ready to dive into. It is very, Absolutely. very healthy. It's got a banana. Is there eight, pineapple? It looks like eight bananas in there. I don't know. Of course, all the portion size is just great value for your buck here at the creamery. You grew up, you grew up coming here, I right? I did grow up. I grew up right here in Delphus. And I tell you what, my favorite story, I had a paper route in the area. And every, <laughs> every week, every day, this woman, a kind woman, would give me a tip so I could come right here to the creamery and enjoy some ice cream. Just one of my favorite childhood memories. And you guys can see why, right? You're not even eating. I, I want to. I'm, I'm trying to facilitate here. I introduced these guys to the Creamery just a year ago, I think. You did, after a football mm -hmm. preview. After yep. a football preview show, and I think that their lives have never been the same. See, so the good. more we eat, he's got to talk. So <laughs> I'm going to take a few bites here. You guys can take take mm. it away. But, I mean, you know, one of the things you, you always know about the Creamery, there's going to be a long line. That tells you people will come and they will wait because it is quality ice cream. And this, do, is, this is good stuff. They do a great job at moving you through, though. And brand new place in back if you want to come and sit. Some tables is that to new? just oh, enjoy. Okay. Maybe bring your mm. family out. Of course, the kids are always going to love it, but fun for the entire family. You can come enjoy some wonderful ice cream. And like you can see, this chicken sandwich, which we haven't been dug into, <laughs> not just ice cream here, but phenomenal food all around. I'm just eating. So you guys continue <laughs> to have a great discussion amongst yourselves, and I'll continue to eat. We can discuss mm. all of these different options. I think we're going to... Well, the only time, good time to eat a banana is in a banana split. Really? Not a banana fan? I don't like the texture, but when you hide it with all the ice cream <laughs> and the cherry and... Yeah. Well, before we go, guys, what is your favorite ice cream treat specifically here at the Creamery? It can be any of these options or anything that you've had. I might be saying the banana split. Really? I, I, I've had before, like, the strawberry shortcake, and that's phenomenal. The milkshakes are gigantic. But I really like the banana split, all the different flavors. Mark, the Buckeye you, well, Buckeye Parfait. You can't go wrong with a waffle cone. This is true. You cannot go wa wrong with a waffle cone. One of the few options they have here, of course, maybe you'll see a shot of the waffle cone here 
I think one dip ends up being five dips. I don't know. It's, it's huge right there on the waffle cone. So. Does anyone actually order the three dip? Do we know what actually comes I've in the three dip? I've heard tail, tall tales, legends about three dips. It's like four 17 dip scoops, cream. something like that. <laughs> it, we're being shown, I think it's two feet high at least. But yes, it is just a ton of ice cream for your for your dollar here. We just we should try that. Maybe in a moment we'll we'll try it. <laughs> <laughs> that was a subliminal hint to well, our that's gonna the manager. Wrap us up on our first road trip of the season. We've enjoyed Delphus and oh, St. Yeah. John's Church, the Postal Museum. Mm. And of course, no trip to Delphus is complete without a trip to the uh, creamery. Right. Mm -hmm. Before we go though, Zach, can you uh, wrap us up in prayer? And we can do that as soon as I clear his ice cream. We forgot to pray before our meal. Yeah. Let's do that right now. God, we come before you and we just thank you for the opportunity that we have to enjoy the weather and the creation that you've uh, put before us. That we can take some time and just enjoy things like the ice cream or being outside in this beautiful day. We pray for our viewers, God, that you would hear... Uh, each of their requests and their praises, God, that they would uh, see WTLW as a way to just edify them in their faith and to continue um, witnessing the gospel. So, God, we ask and thank you for what you're doing right here on Faith and Friends and at WTLW and through our viewers. In your name, amen. amen. All right, that's going to do it for us, guys.